I'm not leaving without getting full motherfucking employment. Why don't you use the 20 grand that you took from me? That should supplement your welfare. I'm not a welfare bum. No? There's a million other places you could probably work. Not right before season. All staffed up. My daughter got an interview in under three minutes. I doubt she got a rap sheet like mine. Boy, you say that with such pride. Listen, Martin. Wouldn't you agree that it's always a good idea to keep your friends close and your enemies closer? Hey, you told your uncles to kill me. Do you remember that? There's a lot of good television now, and you're getting a chance to do things that you've probably not done. I mean, Jason, you've been in this business a long time, and, you know, this is a different time. You're able to do adventurous stuff like this. I imagine. Yes, I mean, I feel very fortunate that I was um, em em embraced, hired, encouraged to do uh, dramatic work. Uh, I, I've, I've dabbled in that. I, I do it when I'm when I'm allowed to. Um, but this was um, this was originally something that I was really excited about doing as a director, and it, it, the the. Um, the challenge for me was, I mean, I'm sort of a, I'm, I'm either a, a, a masochist or a, a hedonist, however you, you look at that job uh, as a director, but I, I, I really wanted to um, challenge myself to direct a 600 page movie. I, I wanted to do, I was gonna direct all 10 episodes. Um, and I talked MRC into it and, and, and Netflix into it. And, um, and then ultimately as we got into budgeting and scheduling, I couldn't carve out enough time to prep them all and ended up just doing the first two and the last two of the, of the first season. But as, as EP on the show, um, it, it allowed me to kind of scratch that same sort of challenge itch uh, by overseeing that whole process. As you know, in television, that, that's sort of the, the responsibility lane that, that's, that's similar to the, to the director on a film. Ruth is such an interesting character. She just comes out all guns blazing, basically, and goes from there. And your whole relationship here with Marty, uh, the character Jason plays, is unique. So you're not from Arkansas. You're not from? No, I'm from Manhattan. <laughs> No, I feel, so, I feel so lucky. I mean, I, Jason is just, I feel so lucky to have worked on this and to play this character and just to be a part of something so special. I remember reading the first episode, and Ruth wasn't in the first episode, um, but there was the audition sides, and I just remember thinking the script was amazing, and I was, I was obsessed with it. I couldn't let it go. And I, I don't have a hard time letting things go, but I, I, I felt like I needed this part. I really loved her a lot. 